We are following breaking news in the case of a missing University of Alabama recent graduate. Good evening, I'm Sherry Jackson. And I'm Jim Dunaway. Friends and family now say that the body found at a crash site in Foster's is that of Zach Koch. CBS 42 News reporter Jamie Ostroff live for us tonight in Tuscaloosa. And Jamie, obviously the family is reeling from this tragic news. It's heartbreaking, Jim, and some some family members I spoke to are coming from out of state. They are not even here yet. They are coming back to this devastating news. Now, I'm here now at Zach's house where his friends have been gathering all afternoon. I did speak with some of them off camera. They said that they started getting news and Facebook updates on their phones. They have been glued to these all afternoon hearing word of that car crash in Greene County on County Road 10. Uh, they said that family members and friends, people that knew Zach Koch have been by the crash site. They said that's where they did see Zach's body. And at this point, they have just been inside consoling themselves and waiting for the family to show up to console them as well. Now, while I do want to uh, respect everybody's privacy, this family uh, obviously very heartbroken. I've spoke to them. They've been very gracious. Uh, uh, Zach's brother did post an update publicly on Facebook. Uh, just a statement. I'm going to read part of it. This is from Justin Koch. He says, I will always feel a pit in my stomach when I know I cannot share life experience with him anymore. I know the Lord always has a plan and I will share life with him again in heaven. We were live in Tuscaloosa this evening. Jamie Ostroff, CBS 42 News.